He did nothing. And yet, all the time... If you had needed me, Jim, I could have loved you more than anything in the world. But you don't need anyone except yourself. She was tired, upset. Monday morning, she'll feel differently. Andy, too. Perhaps I was too abrupt with him, but he's got to understand. This self-sufficiency is the most important thing I can give him. Worth more than his $5,000. That's a schoolboy's dream. He'll forget it. You say you're doing this for Andy, Jim. But actually, it's for you. Always and forever, it's for you. I'll be quiet and restful at the lodge. I can think it all through. It'll work out. I'll work it out by myself. I always do. Hello, Owen. Nice to see you again. Mighty nice to see you, too. Uh, you need some uh, gas and oil? Not now. Oh, up the lodge earlier than usual, ain't you, Mr. Hughes? Yes, I've been south, Owen. Miley. Mm. When I got in this morning, I had a nurse to see this part of the country again. Oh, we had bad winter up here. A lot of wind and rain and snow. May have done some damage out to your place. I'll uh, soon know. The reason I stopped on, uh, this car hasn't had a good checkup since last summer when you tuned it. Oh, well, that's nice of you to say so. I thought you might drive me out to the lodge and help me get settled. Then bring the car back here and work on it. Pick me up, say, uh, Tuesday morning. Well, mighty happy to do it. Always enjoy working on a big car like this one. Well, then hop in. Uh, I want to stop and pick up some groceries in camp.